what is going on everybody and for this video i'm going to be doing a step-by-step -step guide on this new cluck and bell farm heist and i'm going to be breaking down everything that y'all would need to expect and everything that you need to know so for the very first one this is where we're going to start off in the beginning and we're going to be going to these two locations when you get to the location you're just going to have to take out two people then we're going to make our way into these washing machines where you're going to have to take out the money and we're just going to go ahead and take out the money out of both of these and move on to the next one. Once you get the money, we're going to go ahead and go to the second location. Then we're going to be taking out two more people and then we're going to go ahead and raid three more washing machines. And then we're going to be dropping it off right over to this location. And pretty much that's going to be the ending for the first one. Now we're going to be starting the second one, which is breaking and entering. In this mission, it's going to ask you whether to go between these two locations where you're actually going to have to go to both of these locations anyway. So you're actually going to have to find the terabyte. They're going to send you a picture of it and you pretty much have to determine the location within that yellow circle. If y'all do happen to have troubles finding it, it's going to be right here on the map. It will be a swarm of drones as soon as you find the terabyte. So just a heads up. And as soon as you do that, you'll be able to walk inside and you'll be going inside and you'll be collecting the hacking device. Now we're going to be heading to the laptop, which is going to be at the carnival. The laptop is going to be where the restrooms are at, right beside where the arcade games are. Now, I don't know who else felt this way too, but we are now finally able to drive this train. And then we're just going to drive it through this tunnel and we're going to be finished on the second one. And so now we're going to be going ahead and starting number three, which is concealed weapons. For this one, we're going to be going to three different locations. And just a heads up, y'all, I would say make sure that you stock up on your armors and snacks. The first thing I need to tell y'all about this, do not use a rocket launcher or you're going to be looking like me up here, exploding all the stuff you need. And so once you finish all three, we're just going to turn it in. So now once you finish everything, you're just going to hit up Vincent and just confirm that you got all the equipment that you're going to need. And so coming in at number four, we have hit and run. So pretty much y'all, you're going to be going to these three locations, which are all going to be vehicles. And you can collect all three if you want, but these are going to be for your heist. I'm going to be honest with y'all, this is probably the slowest one, but hey, it got the best defense. All right, so just so I can make this a little bit easier for y'all, I found this car at A. And for the very last one, I found this car over at B. For number five, we have Disorganized Crime. So pretty much for this one, we're just going to be terrorizing the cartel and we're just going to keep crashing into their van and we're going to hack into their stuff. Between the two vans, one of those vans are going to have this uniform that you would need to collect for your heist. And now in this same mission, we're going to be driving over to the cartel's garage. When y'all get inside of this garage, try to be as stealthy and as quiet as y'all can because if not, it's going to be one of the guys that are going to snitch on you and then you're going to have all these people coming after you. Now once you take out everybody, we're just going to go through all these lockers and we're going to try to find the key cards that we can use for the computer. This is the most important thing. Make sure that y'all wipe the footage from the CCTV computer. Trust me y'all, when y'all wipe that footage, your heist is going to be a lot more easier. So now, we're going to be going through the storage area and just a heads up, we will be having extra armor too. After you take out everyone, you're going to have to go to three different computers and you're going to have to hack their devices. All three of the computers were actually not that hard to find. They were actually somewhere close to each other, so it should be easy. Now, what we're going to do is from all three of those computers that we hacked and all the codes that we got, we're going to use that to be able to access the safe. And so now they're just going to have you go through two of these storages and pretty much we're just going to be looting through all of these crates. And we're just going to be stealing all the goods and, and after that we can leave right out so now we can finally be able to access the office and as soon as we get up in there we're just going to go ahead and hack the computer right after we hack the computer now we can go ahead and get over to our getaway car that's going to be inside the garage all right everybody so now all we got to do is just deliver this loot to vincent and we are done with this last one and don't even forget about the five hundred thousand. Overall, I actually kind of like this heist and I hope this video helped y'all out. I hope y'all enjoyed it. But until next time, everybody take care.